Uh, hi everybody, my name is Teresa. I'm one of the organizers of Women Tech Makers Frankfurt and we have a special event tonight. Um, we are here at the moment in the Silver Tower um, for uh, DB Sister Deutsche Bahn and in our meetup today we are talking about Google Cloud and we have a special guest here. It's Emma. Emma from Google, thanks for being here. Thank you very much for having me tonight. And as a women tech makers, I'm so excited to have you here as a role model for all the women out there um, want to have a career in technology. And so my first question is how you get started with technology, how you get started your career. So maybe you can tell us a little bit about that. Sure. So I started programming when I was 11 years old. It was a little bit earlier in that age. Um, Uh, I studied programming because I read some books in the libraries and, and bookstores and, and computers, computers and programming seemed, seemed interesting. And, but I wasn't great at math actually in high school, so my high school teacher suggested I study uh, liberal arts instead. Mm -hmm. So I studied and majored in education mm -hmm. and psychology for the first, first year in university. And then my professor came to me and said, mm -hmm. Do you really want to study education? You seem to be more interested in, in computer science and programming. So I switched my major and studied computer science and got my uh, computer science degree and became a professional software engineer. Wow, that's an amazing story, um, especially starting with 11. This is You know, some people are playing with dolls and you're starting with computer science. <laughs> That's very inspiring. And I really like that, that you started just a whole other, in a whole other field and then switched. And now you are, yeah, like a superstar today. You just, <laughs> yeah, are here. We are, this is the second interview we are doing. And yes, this is wonderful. So um, as a women tech maker, I'm also interested, what do you think about communities like women tech makers or our other communities that try to engage women in tech? What do you think? So when I was learning programming, there was nobody around me um, doing programming or using computers. And not only women, but in general, no adults. And it was really hard for me to imagine what a professional software engineer Would look like in the future. I had no idea what kind of job I would do. I had no idea how well I was doing. And I, I joined, uh, I started studying at university and I was still not sure whether programming, uh, software engineering was the right career for me. So I, I was not sure. I started my career Uh, as a software engineer, mm -hmm. finally after six years uh, after joining a university, mm -hmm. and but it is very important to actually see uh, people like you and and um, help you learn programming, mm -hmm. software engineering, but also help you uh, make decisions and and give you confidence that uh, tech and software engineering is the right choice for you. Mm -hmm. So. It is very important to have people like you around you and uh, keep, um, connect, feel connected and feel motivated and inspired. Thank you very much. I think also it's very important and thank you so much to be here and be such an inspiring person and share your story with us. So thank you and have a nice day here in Frankfurt. Thank you very much for, again for having me. It, it, it is my pleasure to be here. Thank you. Thank you.